Hey guys, welcome to the Londonia Family Travels. Today we're going to be discussing the package that we used to go to the Dominican Republic. It was through Costco Travel and we booked our resort as the Barcelo Bavaro Palace Punta Cana package. Um, we chose this just because it was super convenient and it was a great price for a quick getaway for us. The room that we chose was the Junior Suite Oceanfront Premium Level. Now we chose this room because there were just a lot of great amenities that were included and it just happened to be in our price range. Um, coming into the room, it was super pretty, very clean. As you can see, when they give you your bracelets that's to identify you as a guest, that's the bracelet that you'll use to get in and out of your room, which is awesome because you don't have to worry about carrying a card or anything like that. The resort is all-inclusive, which is another great plus. Um, they included that bottle of Barcelo um, rum, which was great. We had a little bit of an issue opening that bottle, so we didn't really get to enjoy it, but maybe someone else can figure out how to open it up. The room being that it is premium level, it included um, robes, which were super comfortable and awesome to wear after a day at the beach. Um, you got little, you also got um, beach towels, got um, sandals included in that um, so it was just a lot of nice little perks that were included we didn't have to worry about going to the towel bar to get any towels they were already included in our room the bathroom was super big super spacious as you can see that shower is huge and it was just so wonderful to use um, they included you know all the typical amenities soap shampoo conditioner things like that just a lot of room in that room which was awesome Double vanity sinks, toilet was to the right. It was just great. And as I said, the room is super big, super spacious, a king size bed. And we also had um, the ocean front view, which was great. We were on the first floor, which offered us just like a great walk out from our back patio. And it also included a jacuzzi outside, which I'll show you in a minute. They had um, some bubble baths set out out there for the jacuzzi, which was a great little extra. And just being outside was so calming, so wonderful. Just having the ocean out there and hearing that during the day was great. Our room number was 2135 in case anyone's interested or wants to request the first floor. Um, we didn't request the first floor and at first we were a little bummed out because we wanted a great ocean view, but then we realized what a great amenity that was because you could just walk out to the beach from your room very easily. Now as you can see there's a premium level lobby right near our room which was great. Anything that we needed we can go to concierge there and this is just us walking over to the main area. It was a quick walk like maybe a five ten minute walk to where all of the restaurants, the spa, the main lobby was and it was just the weather so beautiful it was not you know difficult at all to take these walks. theater where all of the shows are every night. Um, every night there's a different show that goes on. The shows are pretty good quality for the most part. Um, you can tell that they put a lot of work into their shows. And then to the left is the spa. So included in the premium level um, package, you are allowed to use their spa, which includes an infinity pool, um, heated spa, and a cold water. They have a gym, which I'll show you, that's up to the right. The gym was super big, always busy, um, included a lot of nice um, equipment and updated equipment. None of it felt old or, you know, overused, which was awesome. Now this is the spa and the complimentary hydrotherapy. Um, the first pool is the cold water pool, and then the pool closest to the exit was the hot water pool. They also had steam rooms and saunas, which we could use, which was awesome. We didn't have to pay, you know, extra for any of that. It was included in the premium price. They also had, you know, different waters and they had fruits and things available in that area as well. 
as you see, I'm walking out and so I'm gonna be pulling out. It's just really nice if you wanna have a little bit of private time and you don't wanna be with the general population of the other pool. Um, the area that we stayed at was, um, you know, a family friendly resort. They do have an adults only resort on the other side, but we ended up in the family friendly resort just because it just didn't bother us at that point. And then this is just a clip of us, you know, enjoying the pool. The pool was beautiful. The weather in Punta Cana was amazing. So it was a lot of fun. parts the food the resort is an all-inclusive so um, being that we were premium we were able to pick um, and reserve a different restaurant each night if you're not all inclusive I think there's a limit to how many you can do for the most part the food was good there were some restaurants that just really weren't worth it we'll discuss that at the end um, but like I said for the most part the food was really really delicious and these are just a couple pictures of the restaurants and um, the food that we had while we were out there my husband and I, we really enjoyed most of the food at the resort. Um, the only meal that we weren't crazy about was at El Coral. You really could kind of just skip over that restaurant. It is a seafood restaurant, but we just weren't too impressed with it. The quality of the food wasn't that great. Um, other than that, we really, really recommend all of the restaurants. They were really good. The steakhouses were phenomenal. The Mexican food, um, Kyoto, which is their seafood Hibachi restaurant. Um, because it was COVID times, we chose to not do the Hibachi just because we we're going to be with other groups. Um, but it did look really good and we would feel comfortable doing it now just because the pandemic is pretty much over. <laughs> um, other than that, honestly, you couldn't really couldn't go wrong with the food. It was all really, really good. We hope that you enjoyed this video and just this little version of our trip to Punta Cana. We really enjoyed it. It was a really fun time um, and we really, really would go to this resort again and use Costco Travels. It was a great, great experience. We're going to end off on this little clip of us going on their trolley. They have a trolley that goes around the whole resort, which was super convenient. We didn't get to use it until the end of our trip the last day. But it was a lot of fun and we got to check out Hoja 19, which is another restaurant that you're able to go to if you're part of their um, premium package. 
So I hope you enjoyed this and I hope this kind of helps you plan your next trip and vacation. Have fun guys. Thanks.